Sixth event, it is the third division, three-year-old trotting Colts and Geldings, Ohio Sire Sticks. A field of nine, a purse of $20,000. There are no changes. And here are the horses. The one, Rose Run Elvis, sold by Ron and Linda Randall of Berlin Center, Ohio. Dan Ross, the driver. Two, Pop Pop, owned by Donna Jean Anderson of Circleville, Ohio, with Brian Weaver. Three, Striking Murph, over the Keita Farms, and Patricia Wollum of Ohio, Don McCurgan drives. The four, Bad Boy Leroy, owned by Don Elmer of Elmore, Ohio, for Dave Hawk. Number five, Becoming Over, owned by Ron Steck and Robert Chapman of Ohio, the driver Ron Steck. Number six, Naptown Wiz, over the White Creek Stable, Dumblin, Ohio, the driver Ray Paver. Seven, Rick's Victory, owned by Carter and Easter Day of Londonderry and Chillicothe, Ohio, for Steve Carter. The eight Rose Run Expert, joined by Kinsley, Latitian, and Ann Smith with Jeff Smith. Nine, Anastasia Zip, owned by Joe Urban of Mercer, Pennsylvania, Jim Pantliano in the Sulky. Exacta, trifecta wagering. Third division, three year old trotting Colts and Geldings on the back stretch. Nearing the start. And uh, they're off. Rick's victory sent hard for the lead from mid-pack. Be coming over with early speed. To the inside, striking Murph trots out in third. Inside fourth, Rose, Ron Elvis, pop, pop, looks to duck in five. Two lengths in sixth, Anastasia Zip. Another two lengths seventh, Naptown Wiz. Parked out eighth is Rose, Run Expert. And the early trailer following a break is Bad Boy Leroy. Approaching the first quarter mile marker, Steve Carter has Rick's victory on the front. The lead is two. Opening quarter, 28 and one. Charging up on the outside, challenging, and now taking command. It's Rose Run Elvis. So Elvis moves to the front, takes the lead by two. Rick's victory on the inside, trots in second. Becoming over is now back to third. Striking Murph is two lengths off in fourth. Pop, pop, gaffing in five. Anastasia Zip is a closer sixth. Naptown Wiz fishing for cover to the outside. Followed by Rose Run Expert. And the trailer is Bad Boy Leroy. At the half and 57 seconds onto the back stretch, and it's Rose Run Elvis. That lead is two. Rick's victory on the inside trots in second. Be coming over yet to move from third. Striking Murph is there trotting in fourth. Pop, pop, gaps in five. Naptown Wiz waits no more, is now sent after the leaders as they move down the back stretch, approaching three quarters. Rose Run Elvis has opened that lead, a, a, an easy four length advantage as they reach three quarters, 126 and two. Rose Run Elvis leads the way, Rick's victory on the inside, chasing in second, B coming over, tips to the outside after the leader in third as they come to the top of the stretch. It's Rose Run Elvis, the lead still three, Rick's victory on the inside, they've less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Rose Run Elvis, but trotting up on the outside. Here's Rose Run Expert. Rose Run Expert, Rose Run Elvis. They come to the wire together. They're there. A very tight photo in 157-3. and three. Photo for win. Sixth race official. Trackside official winner of the third division, Ohio Sire Stakes, the eight Rose Run Expert. A three year old big gilding by Ombra Laser out of special measure by Supergill. The Kinsley, Leighton and Smith of North Carolina, Texas, and Ohio. Jeff Smith, the trainer driver. Final surge for Rose Run Expert. Earns him a win, a record win, his second of the season, 157. Three fifths. Track side making trophy presentations. Dr. John Mossberger, he's the current president of the OHHA. Rose Run Expert returns $20.60 to win, $4.80 to place, $4.20 to show.